Joining me now, House Oversight Committee member, Congressman Trey Gowdy. Congressman, good to see you, and good for you, because it takes work to actually go through the record and, and tick it off like that so that the American public has an understanding about what you're doing in there. Um, and, and you went to the heart of it, which is what he proved, what the FBI proved, maybe it was a crime, maybe it wasn't, but it was absolutely that she misled over and over and over again. Your thoughts? Well, there's no question she made false statements to the public. Uh, but the reason I went through that exercise with Director Comey is, let's assume he's right and there's an intent element in, in the statute. Um, I think there was circumstantial evidence that she had the intent. And one way to prove circumstantial uh, prove intent by circumstantial evidence is false exculpatory statements. Innocent mm -hmm. people don't lie. So if you have a series of false statements, then you need to ask yourself, why do you feel the need to mislead? It might be consciousness of guilt. Mm -hmm. and, and what do you think the response to that is? I mean, he basically was looking at history saying, we just haven't done it. We haven't prosecuted people for gross negligence. Um, I, you know, John Radcliffe is one of my colleagues from Texas. Uh, he believes that it has been done, but let's assume Director Comey is right. Um, that's true with every statute until somebody decides to do it. Um, but should and, you be doing?